OK, this time I'm going to use Desmos.com to create a histogram for the ages of the best actors winners for the Oscars. Uh, you can see that I still have my list typed in here of all the ages from 1970 to 2001. And I even still have the box plot that we created a minute ago displayed over here just by typing box plot bracket and A for my list of ages. Now to make a histogram, it's just as easy. All I have to do is type histogram bracket, put A, but then I also want to say a bin width. So if you see right here, it says there are two arguments for the histogram uh, function here. One is the data set that you want to graph. That's my age is A. And then I can put a second thing that's the bin width. And that's basically the range of ages that will fit into each one of these bars. Right now, it's set for like one year difference, which doesn't really give us a lot of information. I can see the bars graphed there and I can see, oh, 40 year olds, they were the most common. But to make the graph a little more visual, I can set a, a wider range for the ages, like maybe a five year age range. That'll give me a little bit better visual on the graph. Okay, so now it's gone off screen and I'm gonna hit the little zoom to fit. There we go. Uh, I'm not really too fond of that fit. I'll zoom that in just a little bit. So now you can see on my histogram here that, oh, a lot of the people who won an Oscar are in this group here that are somewhere around 40 years old. Uh, it's five year age gap there. So between 37 and a half and 42 and a half, that's where the most people that have won the Oscar for Best Actor fit into if I make the bin width five years. Uh, there are five, six, seven, eight people who are in that age group. And there are six people who are in the age group 42 and a half up to 47 and a half. And there are three people in the age group 47 and a half up to 52 and a half. So the histogram gives us another nice view of what the typical age for winners for the Best Actor Oscar are. And we can see from the histogram that it looks like most of the people group up somewhere around about 40 years old. The box plot sort of gave us the hint it was, you know, early 40s. And the histogram is agreeing with that. This person that was 76 when they won the Best Oscar, wow, they were really separated from the rest of the people. That's actually a very a surprisingly old age, not a typical age to win a Best Actor Award. If you're not too happy with how good of a visualization you're having, you can always adjust that bin width. Maybe five years is too much, maybe four years. Ooh, I don't like that one as much. Uh, how about three years? Okay, it gives me a little hint that maybe the actual average is a little less than 40 years old. Anyway, it it's not an exact science for setting the bin width. If I made it entire decades, oh, look at that. People between 35 and 45 are going to win the most often. Yeah, sure, but that's a really wide range too. So I'm playing off how much information I get versus how specific the graph becomes. Uh, I think I like the age range of five years the best, and that's the one I'll keep. All right, thanks for playing.